Hercules was in disgrace because he had refused to eat his wholesome bread and milk on the grounds that there was a frog in it. E. What was the punishment given by his aunt? Nicholas was not allowed to go to the sands at Jagborough where the other children were going as a special treat. E. How did the frog come into Nicholas' basin of milk and bread? There was a frog in Nicholas' basin of milk and bread as he had had put it there himself to prove the older, wiser and better people wrong. IV. Find a word from the extract which means the same as, healthy and nutritious wholesome bee in the afternoon. The aunt spent an hour or two in trivial gardening operations whence she could watch the doors that led to the forbidden area. Nicholas wriggled his way with obvious stealth of purpose towards one of the doors. I. What was the forbidden area? The gooseberry garden was the forbidden area. E. How did the aunt spend her time in the afternoon? In the afternoon, the aunt spent an hour or two in trivial gardening operations whence she could watch the doors that led to the forbidden paradise. E. Why did Nicholas want his aunt to think he had got into the gooseberry garden? Nicholas wanted his aunt to think he had got into the gooseberry garden because he wanted to go to the lumber room. IV. Answer the following questions in 30 to 40 words. A. Why did the aunt guard the entrance of the gooseberry garden that afternoon? The aunt knew that Nicholas would go to the gooseberry garden because she had told him not to. Hence, she spent time guarding the entrance of the gooseberry garden because she did not want him to enjoy his detention time in the gooseberry garden. B. What did Nicholas find in the lumber room? Inside the lumber room, Nicholas found an interesting tapestry picture, candlesticks in the shape of snakes, a teapot fashioned like a china duck, a carved sandalwood box packed with aromatic cotton wool and brass figures of hump-necked bulls, peacocks and goblins and a large square book full of colored pictures of birds. See how did Nicholas mislead his aunt in order to carry out his plan to enter the lumber room. Nicholas made frequent trips into the front garden to mislead his aunt and make her believe that he wanted to enter the gooseberry garden, whereas his actual plan was to discover the secret of the lumber room. D. Why did the aunt call out to Nicholas for help? The aunt called out to Nicholas for help because she had slipped into the rainwater tank and wasn't able to get out. She wanted Nicholas to bring the little ladder from under the cherry tree. 3. Answer the following questions in 80 to 100 words. A why were the rest of the children given a special treat? Whenever a child was under punishment, the aunt used to organize picnics or something of a festive nature in which the offender was not allowed to participate. The aunt decided to send the other three children to Jagborough as she wanted to punish Nicholas for his disgraceful behavior at the breakfast table when he had brought a frog and put it in his bread and milk. Thus, the offender was made to feel sorry for his mistake. In this case to punish Nicholas, she was sending the rest of the children to Jagborough. E. How did Nicholas spend his time in the lumber room? First, Nicholas misled his aunt to make her believe that he wanted to enter the gooseberry garden, whereas his actual plan was to discover the secret of the lumber room. Nicholas was fascinated with the exhibits of the lumber room as it was forbidden delight for him. Then, his aunt fell into the rainwater tank. Though he knew it was his aunt, he acted as if he was talking to someone who was trying to mislead him into entering the forbidden gooseberry garden. Thus, it was a fun-filled day for him. Language. 4. Match the phrases with the meanings. A. Uh, IVB. Vi C. V D. E. E. I. F. E5. Punctuate the following sentences correctly. The older, wiser and better people had told him that he was not to talk nonsense. B. Nicholas. Nicholas. She screamed, you are to come out of this at once. C. I've slipped into the rainwater tank. D. Your voice doesn't sound like aunt's, objected Nicholas. E. Will there be strawberry jam for tea? Asked Nicholas innocently.